Hey, this is Eric with VBAHowTo.com, and I'm here to give you an answer to a question I got in another video of mine. It was uh, how how can you make a report based on whatever's selected in a form? So anyway, I'm going to show you all how to do that. Pretty easy, and actually, th this this your report. This is something really simple. So I'm going to close this out, and basically. The other video showed how to make the make this select uh, select select from this list. Like if you want to do, uh, see what items come with the beer basket. Select the items for the basket. You see all these things in the basket. These uh, seven items, and then the basket report. Bang! You have seven items in in your basket report. And if you want to select your uh, pastry basket, here we have all of our items for the basket, uh, all nine items. And here are the nine items for the pastry basket. So the way I'm doing this is uh, I'm just going to go into alternate F11 here and pull it over my screen. Basically, this with the other video discussed this uh, by the top, but and of course you get this database at vbahowto.com. So I'm going ahead and open up the report uh, with a preview mode, so I can not have to print this out all the time. I can see it on my screen beforehand. And if you notice that these two arguments here, okay, I click and I can go to each and every argument and this last one is open args and I want to get the arguments the open args of whatever that subform sub was so I'm passing that subform the record source for that because I'm f filling it right here in this top top part with whatever my selection is and I'm going to now open the report and whenever it opens I'm checking for the the open args okay if if there are some there I go ahead and fill the record source of the report with those open args and that's how you do it and so anyway your results going to be uh, a basket report it's going to pass the uh, pass whatever you selected from this last year it's pretty pretty neat I think I'm gonna keep on clicking this is really just to set the set the record source and there are multiple different ways to do this uh, this is just one one way to do it um, and here are three items for this tea basket and three items so anyway, uh, this is Eric, VBAHowTo.com. Check me out. Check out the website. Get the uh, look down near the link below, uh, the comments below, rather, and see the the link to the video at the website or link to the database of the website. And be sure to subscribe and like, and feel free to leave a comment. Uh, about anything that you want to see in another video so like if you have something that you want to yeah uh, you're pondering or whatever you're trying to figure out how to do something so and I'll see what I can do about helping you out and make a video and I uh, help in posting it posting it here so thank you much for listening in